Are you serious? You really here packing up a box to leave because I lost my job? I am so We get married in less than a month. You doing this right now? That moment you realize that your girlfriend is cheating on you. So my girlfriend moved into an apartment last month and today she finally invited me over and I realized something really today. So for the last couple of weeks, my girlfriend's been getting FaceTimes and texts from a guy saved under her phone as landscaper. So I asked her, I'm like, why is a landscaper texting and calling you? Like that doesn't make any sense. And she told me that she just wanted to show her if he liked the way he cut the grass. So stupid me believed all this horse and I'm walking here right now and I'm looking at the grass, right? And I'm like, wow, maybe maybe he is doing a good job and he wants to brag about how good of a job he's doing. But then I realized it's f***ing fake grass. The guy's not cutting grass. He's probably visiting her in her f***ing dorm. Okay, the turf basically reveals the truth in this entire thing. She needs a better excuse than that because even if the turf wasn't there, there is no good reason for you to be texting a landscaper like that. Could you handle all three of us at once? Maybe not. I'm just kind of new to this, but... Uh, new to what? i never done a f***ing so I'm being real. You want to find out? It's a f***ing... I don't know. You're saying no to us? I'm not saying no, but I'm Bruh. saying maybe. We need a yeah. Should he have him? He could, I wouldn't. Damn, why? See the only fan shirt, you're like average at best. No. Please look at yourself. Before you come at me sideways, make sure you're better looking and make sure you make more money than me. Well, I'd like to see what you look like underneath all that makeup. Let's do the wet wipe challenge. Let's do it. At the end of the day, you're out in Wynwood and we're making money. And you're out just getting plastered. I mean, I'm pretty sober, I don't know about you. All right, to be fair, this guy does not know those girls like that, and it's probably the biggest reason why he should not join them. This is mostly for the girls, and then the guys can like give their opinions. Do you feel prettier and hotter both when you dress sure. more risque or more modest feminine vibes? Modest feminine, for yeah. sure. Yeah. I feel like a, like a boss bitch. Yeah, like, like, I mean, like, this is my Saudi outfit. Like, who cares, you know? I love it. It's fun. But when I'm in, like... Let's see a blazer, a cute like little professional long sleeve. It's like I, on top of feeling beautiful, I feel like almost powerful. But I feel like in the last year or so, like my style is like ever so changing when it comes to confidence. Mainly because like compared to when I was like 21 or 22. Chase, why are you laughing? Chase, why are you laughing? Nothing. Sorry, he's laughing. Please I'm, continue. He's Please laughing continue. at the chat. <laughs> How dare you, Chase? Please continue, as you were saying. Um, no, just like basically saying that like compared compared to when I was younger, like let's say I'm wearing like a little black slip dress and you know like a little wedge to the club with a YSL bag, that would make me feel pretty. But like as I'm getting older, it's like almost like when I cover up, it's like you feel more beautiful. But like I guess that's something that comes with age, and like I feel like a lot of younger girls. Yeah. Well, but what age did you start identifying as a woman? Can I experiment more like clothing? Oh, sorry. Um. Your friend good? It sounds like you're making a lot of jokes there. <laughs> I don't know. The, the chat was saying some ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, everyone's got their preferences, I guess. I don't know who needs to hear it, but check it out. Tell me if I'm lying. It's nothing more than a woman touching her lips together and shutting the. I'm going. All right, that was a huge plot twist, and it seems like someone is extremely unhappy. You bold. So she drove my car to your to your house for real, bro. All the way clean. Wow. Why why would you do that? Why would you drive about, my car? About twice so far. Hold on, what? Yeah, about twice. She drove my car twice? Yeah. Hope you seen my, my, my phone in the Bluetooth. The ABM Ali shit. That much. Huh? Did I connect my phone to the Bluetooth and everything? That ABM Ali? That was on the Bluetooth? That was my shit. Wait, so you're telling me that not only did she go to cheat, but she also used his car to go and do that? That is absolutely heartless. That's what they start doing. What do you do in response to that? Cody, I have a question. I <laughs> think this was over. Listen, you're in public. You're without me. You're out. You're looking good. You're smelling good. Looking crispy, fresh. And some baddie, I'm talking 10 out of 10 straight across the board, starts coming up to you, trying to hit on you, trying to flirt with you. Mm -hmm. It's like, ooh. Mm -hmm. Ooh, what's your number? You got a girlfriend? Mm -hmm. You got a wife? That's what they start doing. What do you do in response to that? 
How bad are we talking? <laughs> Don't. Do not. Right now. I'm kidding. What? Relax. Listen. What do you listen, do? Listen. Listen. You want to know what I'll do? Yes, I'm going to right? do. Let's let's role play a little bit. Okay. You pretend. Okay, fine. And then I will pretend that I'm at the bar having a drink. You come up to me, try to hit on me. Okay. Hey, good looking. I think you're mighty handsome. I like that little beard you got going on there. I'm married. Cody, I. <laughs> I just. I just. So I just. So much more I just got my conscience done. <laughs> you passed. Oh my god, not only did this man just pass the test, but he also taught his girlfriend a lesson about asking questions like that. He didn't even need to say anything to shut her up. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god. She literally came in and asked me if I had her and she apologized for having I'm like, I'm shaking. She asked if I was into Liberty Kills and she said that I look like a, what the I'm scared. She asked if I'm a Liberty Kills guy and that I look like I kill for Liberty. Hi. And airplanes fly over me every day? No. Yeah, are you taking pictures of me? I'm videotaping, yeah. Really? Yes. Are you into Liberty Kills? I'm not into Liberty Kills. Are you sure about that? You look I'm like positive. The, you like a, like a primo Liberty Kill guy. I don't even know what that like is. Like you're the Liberty Kill Charge team. Like all you do is get everyone to kill Liberty chicks, right? I don't know what that is, I'm sorry. This is probably the most confusing video I've ever watched because what in the world is Liberty Kills and what does it have to do with herpes? Groom played a video of his wife cheating on him with her pregnant sister's husband in front of everybody. At a wedding? This is absolutely insane. Like, she can't be mad at him because she's the reason that this all went down like that. What is the worst job for a girlfriend to have? Why? I don't mean, I don't want other guys up in my girl's box. You just like to munch it to yourself? Of course. Eat it from the back, always. Yeah. What is the worst job for a boyfriend to have? I'm not into guys. I don't really care what other dudes do. I did mean if it was, yeah. This man has a respectable answer. Is it selfish to want your girl to yourself? If that's what people are starting to think nowadays, then we have some problems. That Let's mean? pray. Wait, why? Because we always pray at home. No, but the guy here knows how to cook. All right, my bet is this guy is sleeping on the couch tonight. Hey guys, so me and my best friend are gonna do a video together today. Ready? We're gonna make a so, little TikTok, okay? So first, come here. Stop. What? All right, kiss my cheek. No. No. <laughs> I want a real kiss. You no. won't give me a kiss. No, because you're my best friend. Why not? Sarah, stop. Why? We can't. I just want to smooch before. We no. Are you kidding no, me? No, here, here, smooch. You know you give me a kiss on the lips? Just come here. Stop. Why? I want a kiss. Because you're my best friend. I'm not trying to sound like that guy, but if roles were reversed, this man would have been in jail. This is literal sexual assault, and the fact he says no multiple times shows it. Hey, if you want a woman to be looking at you like that, then you definitely got to start putting in the work to get a body like that. We all can do it. It just takes dedication and discipline.
Honestly, if you look closer, it looked like she was looking at pictures of other men. Maybe it was Instagram or it was a dating app. If it was, then that is just devastating. What would you do if I had a lot of male friends? Sorry? I have more male friends. I don't understand the question. So you don't want me to have any male friends? 100%. Thank you. Next. Nope, male friends are a big no-no. If your girl has a boy best friend, then you need to pray to whatever God you believe in because it might not end well. Are you sure that that's not a child? Because this looks worse than what a child would do. So you pack your and you get the This is actually depressing. It's crazy to see someone who you can be so close to switch up on you that easily. Okay, I love the wordplay here and he's totally right. Like sometimes you just need a new person to connect with and always remember that there are more fish out in the sea. And women out here wonder why there's a huge group of men that are done dating and done with relationships. Because that man is not impressed. He actually thinks that lady now is probably the most unattractive person in the room. And now he understands that women can be extremely disloyal, even right before she's about to marry a man. And over time, if he has enough of these experiences, he'll probably become one of those guys that um, don't want a relationship and just want to chill in peace. Did she just ask him to change her mind about being engaged? I pray to God that her husband finds out about this. You got fake eyelashes, you got fake hair, you got fake ass, you got fake everything on your body, but you want a real Like, I worked hard for these results. I suffered. I went through the fire, adversity builds character. I went through the fire for this. Okay, he's actually speaking facts here because a lot of women get a bunch of plastic surgery and fake their entire lives and then expect men to be real about everything, which is totally hypocritical if you ask me. But I dumped a girl. She was bad for me. Every time I brought this girl out, she was flirting with all my friends. Every time she was just flirting. And I told her, I'm like, I don't think you should be flirting with my friends. It's weird. And she's like, oh, I'm just joking. You don't need to worry about it because they're just jokes. But then uh, she to one of my friends. And I'm like, I, I don't think you know how jokes work. <laughs> you're not supposed to do the thing you're joking about. She did all the excuses in the book. She's like, oh, I have PTSD. And my PTSD makes me do crazy things sometimes. But that actually kind of makes sense. Because now that I think about it, this was a lot like the time my uncle came back from Iraq and uh, f my friends. <laughs> Okay, did she just use PTSD as an excuse? I feel like every day that passes, there are more BS excuses like this. Good for him. He found my OF page. And he's packing up his sleeve. I don't care what anybody says, if your girlfriend has an OnlyFans and she does not tell you, that is cheating. Did you guys like boyfriend and girlfriend by chance? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Do you guys mind swapping phones for this test? Oh yeah, cool. Don't no, mind. Yeah, yeah. Swapping phones, yeah. I'm just ready. I'm ready. Let's do this. It's very nice out here. Yeah, babe, babe, babe. Mm. Swap the phones. Huh? Oh, phone. oh, sorry. <laughs> my phone is um, personal. Um, it's for the clients. We have one phone. My other phone's at home, so this is the phone. work, you work phone. You have two phones? When do you have two phones? Okay, so this is your work phone? Yeah. Okay, so do you mind Do you mind if he looks at it? Well, just remember it's my work phone. Okay, so why are you being so hesitant? No, someone's right. calling, someone's calling. Just pick up the phone call, pick up the phone call. Hello? 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 Who this? Who's this? Why have you got Corinne's phone? Hey, Corinne, why are you ringing? Yeah. You're huh? right. Take the phone back, take the phone no. back, take the phone back. Take the phone back, take the phone back. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know, take the phone, I phone back. Take the phone, phone back. Hey, yo, why did you pick up the phone? My client gets a bit nervous. He's nervous, yeah? Who's that? Yeah. You're the therapist, so why are you calling her for? She's not at work right now. No, but I've got to have it on 24 hours, babes. Oh, I've got an appointment. Is it? So you can't just send a text or email? No, you no, no, no that's my business. Which yeah. one do you have this business for? I don't have this number. How do you have this number? Well, why would you? It's, I'm 
I do what I do and I do it very well with my hands. So we wouldn't mind if we check the messages, right? Yeah, let's do this. Check the messages. End the call and check the messages. Take the phone. 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 What are you doing? Take the phone. 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 Take the phone, take the phone. Take the phone, take the phone. Hey, check, check, check. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Hey, yo, 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 stop, stop. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh. The moment she started paying attention to the weather was the moment that things started going downhill. Caught my Flirting wife flirting man. outside the taco right truck. Yo, I'm flirting. My name is Kai. Hey, Javier. Listen, Javier, I think you're cute. I like your dungaree jeans and your soccer jersey with the AT&T on it. And you I'm looking to find a, a better man. The guy that I have, he's just he's just a loser. But you look like a winner, Javier. Yeah, I, I, I work at the, the Walmart right around the corner right there. And I, I, I want to take you to my special place. <laughs> I mean, this could be a normal conversation, but it's still hilarious hearing him do the accents and making up a whole backstory about him working at Walmart. Alright, that has to be super cringe feeling, especially since it's on TV. What's the worst date you've ever been on? Today. What yeah, happened yeah. tonight? And, uh, what happened? Was it a double date? Yes, it was. Bro, they were fat. But wh how did you see them online? We saw them on IG on Tinder. Where'd you take them? We dropped them off. You never took them anywhere? We picked them up and dropped them off. <laughs> what did you do? You just circled around the block? I see them walking. Me and yeah, him were like okay. front seat. We're like, what the f is this? We pretend we know the place. And then we tell them, oh yeah, it's right here. So they get off first and we just get off. You just did that tonight. Yeah, yeah, tonight. It's an evil world we live in. I mean, if they're catfishing, they deserve to be treated like that. There is no other way on this one. Are you guys like friends by chance? Yes. What the hell? Do you know what it means? What does it mean? Infinity for best friends forever. Are you single or are you taken? I'm single. I know I have a boyfriend. Do you know her boyfriend by chance? Oh, yes. No. It's such an Why? He just treats her like He's got this girl friend. Not a friend that's a girl that he's very close with. On yeah. date. It's a bit too much at the moment. He's clearly f someone else. Do you think he's cheating? A hundred percent. For this video, is it alright if you call her boyfriend and ask him to Netflix and chill and just see if he's loyal? Yeah. yeah. He's fine. He's a good boy. Hello? Hello? He's just stopped pulling my boyfriend. Where's Steve? Babe, who the f is? I don't be pulling you. Give me the f. Told you. Told you. Who the f is this? You're on my boyfriend's phone. Oh, you're getting twisted. She said she's your f girlfriend, mate. Told you. Put her on the f phone. Put her on the phone. What did I tell you? There's someone else on the phone. Take it, I'm not talking to you. Who's that girl? It's, you know who it is, it's her. Yeah. Told you. Saying she's his friend. You better be f***ing his bags by the time You better f*** your bags while we're packing them for you. Done, babe. I'm done. I'm not doing this anymore. You talk to him. Me? Yeah, tell him to go. Tell him you're all that. Do you know what's going on right now? I'm with your girlfriend right now. He's with your girl. You're with another girl. What's going on? He just took me out for lunch, babe. Yeah, he took me out for lunch. <laughs> no, I, I didn't take her out for lunch. This is a loyalty test and you're failing the loyalty he test. He has failed. What a surprise. No, I don't want to hear it on the phone. Talk to me when we get home and I'll do oh, it. Oh, yeah. You better go running back okay, to okay, him. I'm going to end the call. Okay. You're going to go running back to him. What are you going to do when you get home? Are you okay? She's, bro, she's upset. Oh, oh no, she, bro, she's crying. Not really though. Why have you got to be like that? Well, he's with his with his friend, who's actually probably his. Are you even with him? A nice car. He's got lots of money. He can take me wherever You're I want. With him for the money. The only reason you let him get away with all the that he does is because of the car he's got and the money he's got. Man, her friend is exposing her and her boyfriend. That is absolutely insane. But here is your lesson to not get matching tattoos with anybody. I keep my attention. People talking about that's that's silly. You have to release. No, you have to release. I don't watch. I got discipline. I keep my life force in me. I take that energy and put it in the gym. After a man release, they get tired and have to go to sleep. You that's giving true. away your hair follicles. because you giving away your bone marrow. You giving away your life force. Your body can't even heal itself when you release too much. Sleep. All right, this sounds kind of weird at first, but he has a point. You can definitely use your time and energy for something way more productive. Okay, a little bit further. Okay. Happy birthday to you. Am I yeah, you can look now. Happy birthday to you. 
Happy birthday, dear Bianca. Happy birthday to you. Hey, babe. Are you packing my sh Yeah. Why? Because I busted you cheating on me. Even though she's trying to cover her face, it's not going to help at all because this will go completely viral. Please. I mean, if it was a yes, absolutely, but... Ah, yes, yes. No. Yeah, no, yes, 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 yes. yes. Oh, Michael Jordan! <laughs> Alright, this is why Kai is my favorite streamer, because he does crazy stuff like this. Wait, I'm just wondering. Do you want to kiss? Yeah. You okay? Wait, how can I... To be honest, kissing strangers is not something people normally or ever should do, so go figure. Are you serious? Are you serious? You really here packing up a box to leave because I lost my job? I am so serious. We get married in less than a month. You doing this right now? Yes. Because I lost my job? You won't even tell me how you lost it. It don't matter. I'm going to get another job. It does matter. You're my future wife. Do you have another job already? You're my future wife. You're about to you're move the hell you me down. You can't support me. But you're going to hold me down. Why don't you get you're my house? You're taking health. We can read your vows in less than a month. What you mean? This is practice right now. I'm just saying. And you already did it. Soon we go through some hard. I lose my you already packed them a box. Yeah. No, it's more than that. It's what about having it? accountability, taking responsibility you, for so your you actions. You took the ring off? I did. Are you serious? Yes. We get, are you serious right now? I'm sorry. Cut off my job? Look. That's the I'm, most selfish. Like, what? All I'm saying is that you lost your job, so right now there's no money coming in. Our savings. Oh, can you get a job for right now? Let me, let me figure it out. What you mean? Why do I need to get a job? Because I'm what working doing? this whole time. Now you want to sit up here and try to get me to get a job? And you lost your job? I'm saying what you're doing the most. I, I can serious? get another job. Like, what you mean? You okay, you and need? I'm just supposed to sit around here and watch everything get snatched from And this is what happened for my future wife, y'all. Y'all see this? This is how my future wife acting right now. 